Uh, maybe I should just use what is this? Yeah, that should probably work. And then just uh, just add a bit of a lighter green in some areas so that it gets more turquoise. So I'll, I'll uh, add a bit of black where I have white all over the place. there it seems Uh, hey, base, uh, base meeting. How's it going? Uh, what's going on? I think I'll hit this with a bit of a black. Uh, Uh, maybe too much, just uh, a bit of a black wash so that we have shadows. I usually avoid pure black, but uh, here that's just completely in the shadow. I'm fine, I'm just relaxing here, uh, to be fair. <laughs> it's always uh, Always a bit of a change to to paint the base and not uh, not directly on the miniature, since yeah, I usually try to paint up to a showcase standard and then you have to paint eyes that are half a millimeter. Mm. Yeah, <laughs> while it's fun, it's uh, it can be straining a bit. So this is actually quite relaxing here. Okay, I think everything is covered. So let's go back to the green. And this is again uh, German uniform, our German green. And I'll probably mix that, mix that uh, with some turquoise.
say maybe mix a bit of field grey and turquoise into the base color. Here also just the middle part with the lighter with the lighter tones. So yeah, that, that green kind of, well, green-white kind of adds, like I said, that extra uh, patina effect. So it just looks like oxidized metal here. And when I'm when I'm painting bases, I usually just use a bit more of a worn brush and not the not my top quality brushes. And usually when I'm painting freehands, I'll just add a couple of um, a couple drops of drying retarder, simply because it will enable me to uh, to rub it off with a bit of um, a wet brush again.
use the, the more worn brush again. And I'm going to rub. Try to bring back the, the diamonds. some burnt umber here and um, I thought about making it a lot more greasy but I don't know if that would make sense uh, up there on the mountaintop gotta be careful because uh, this red brown over white always looks a bit funny So I have this uh, Arabic shadow and some aged white and both mixed to, to an interesting yellow. But at this stage, I don't want to overdo the weathering. Just adding a scratch or two. I'll just turn this into a Roman 2. I really feel it should be wider. So watch me screw it up completely.
I think I'll leave it like that. Unfortunately, this here looks um, doesn't look that good anymore. It looked a bit better when it was just a green, and uh, and um, the green and just the darker uh, diamond showing through. Yeah, uh, I'm going to see a movie, that's why I'm going to quit earlier today. So thanks everyone for stopping by and see you next week.